Also, why did the bike roar when she came through the freaking waterfall? And why did she bring the bike through the waterfall? Why didn't she just leave the bike somewhere? And how did she do that jump? I don't fucking understand anything! Nice to meet you, Snake. Oh, Talk game. Amazing game. You're fucking losing it. You're Here's losing your the plot. Uber, you could use a towel. And a brain. So could you. Possibly two. Also, I could use a hell of a lot more than a fucking towel, and I'm not saving because... What's the point? I save state. I've been losing save files, there's no point saving. Om nom nom nom. You know, I actually wouldn't mind trying a snake. But I guess I'm weird. He makes snakes look tasty. Want some? No thanks. And no, I'm not gonna stare at her body. Don't her like low snakes. detail polygonal body. Didn't you have to eat them at the KGB? In my training, we always got the good stuff. French, Italian. Then you weren't in Russia during Soviet times. A regular Matahari. The least you could do is call me Cynthia. Tell me something. How does it feel to spy on your own country? I can't say it feels good, but it's my job. Can't my even gerb. eat a snake during a mission, huh? Took my gerb! I wouldn't mind eating you. Honestly, she just annoys me more than anything. When this mission's over, you'll have to treat me to a nice dinner. What do you want to eat? Let's see. How about sushi? Sushi? It's Japanese. I hear it's all the rage right now. Supposedly, it's made from raw fish. Eh, not quite, but still. Raw fish? Just the place for my survival techniques. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, a moth. What a thrill. Aw, no death perception. That sucks. He's really butthurt about snake. it, too. Thank you, Snake. What a thrill. I'll be your eyes from now on. <laughs> I have an eye. I'm fine. I'm I am a beholder. I float and I have one eye. <laughs> I think Kakashi has my other eye. Thank you. Yeah, I think he's right to do that, actually. Don't worry about it. Are you alright? It's not like I can't see. I've got one good eye and can still fire a gun. Really? Good. And that one-eyed monster spits in your eye. Looking good. Got my gear again. Eva, didn't you steal some explosives out of the fortress? C3, a highly potent explosive from the west. Was there a C2? Be into any shape like clay. With just this much, you could blow up the Shagohat and the lab along with it. Is that right? Yeah, but there's a trick to using it. Tell me about it. Well, what do you think? I think you're nuts. The Shagohod's booster unit uses liquid fuel. 
The fuel tanks are in the main wing of the weapons lab in the hangar housing the Shagohod itself. So I should blow up the tanks? That's the basic idea. It should be enough to blow up the entire hangar. There are four fuel tanks. In order to destroy the hangar, you'll have to set explosives on each of those tanks. All four of them? It should be no sweat for you. Besides, the scientists had the day off today. So the hangar's completely deserted. Not quite. They've still got guards posted there. So what do I do after I set the C3? The bombs Blow it up. run off a timer. Once the timer has been set, the countdown will begin. When the timer reaches zero, the bombs will all go off at once. <laughs> that How makes long do no I sense. Have? 20 minutes. Once the phase two trials are finished, I wouldn't be surprised if they kill all the scientists to prevent them from talking. So you've got to act fast. I'll take care of it. Yay, let's do it. Eva, did you get the data on the Shagohod from Sokolov? Yeah, that's the mission I was given. By Khrushchev? Mm-hmm. America doesn't have any use for it, does it? But I haven't forgotten my other mission either. Helping you out. I cracked a smile. Follow this cave I and think. go up the ladder at the end. You'll come out inside Groznygrad, just southwest of the weapons lab. Do you remember when you went to rescue Sokolov? No. Remember there was a locked door when you entered the main wing from the second floor of the east wing? No. Yeah. That's the entrance to the Shagohod's hangar. Woo. Learn something new every day. I wouldn't have Use guessed. Key to open that door. The door right when I entered the main wing? Got it. It's the only what door that uses this kind I'll of key. I'll get things ready for our escape. There's a rail bridge to the north. I'm gonna set a bomb there, so I'm taking half of the C3 with me. Right. I'll set off the weapons lab then. Try not to be in the neighborhood when it happens. Gotcha. And watch out for Ocelot. He suspects you're not who you say you are. Don't it's worry. not just a suspicion I anymore. Still trust me. And I have my ways. There's not a man alive who can resist my charms. Uh, Besides you, of course. I'm just warning you, Eva. That's all. I He's know. more into Ocelot. Okay, let's go. You seem like you were born on one of those. <laughs> if I didn't ride every day, I couldn't go on living. Huh? When I'm riding, the wind hits me so hard that it hurts. That pain keeps my mind off the pain of having to be someone else. Cool story. It's not easy always fooling myself like this. It's only when I'm on the bike that I'm free to be the real me. I only get off my bike when I fall in love or fall dead. Yeah, no one notices What's you riding that bike around. Tatiana. No. Your real name. <laughs> What's wrong with Tanya? Huh. Okay, Tanya. Don't let anyone see you. Huh. Oh, this? It's a button camera. Then why did it make the loud shutter noise? What did you do that for? Insurance. To make sure you don't double cross me. What would a picture of a dude standing there with an eye patch prove? Also, this bit proves that she's a friggin' retard. Exactly. How do you make that jump? You know, I'm done questioning this game. <laughs> it's only when you replay a game like this that you realize just how dumb it really is. And that for loving it so much back in the day, it proves that we were more just hyped because it was Metal Gear Solid 3 than by it actually being something that made sense because really it's a cheesy spy story wrapped in Metal Gear. Not that that's bad, but it's clearly not something that's like amazingly well written. It's certainly not Bioshock Infinite level pretentious nonsense or Mass Effect 3 level fucking betrayal of all that it stood for. 
but it's still just crazy and completely wacko. This game is to video games what Commando, the Arnold Schwarzenegger movie, was to movies. It's a fun, just suspension of disbelief, completely throw everything out the window video game. I do like it for that, but still, I'm gonna tell you, it's fucking stupid. It is. But I love it. Anyway, I should actually get on with playing the game. But I don't know if I should start dicking around with some settings again because it's possibly gonna lag like a bitch up there. And I changed some settings to make it run more stable earlier. But we shall see. Also, I should make a new save state slot, just in case. But he looks friggin' knackered. Yeah, well, convenient that this thing wasn't covered by anything, right? Also convenient that he did not notice me and still can't see me in that position. Bit of a blind driver there. Also, he is parking that thing next to the tanks, where you would probably park a tank. Right? That's kind of odd, and he parked it directly on top of the thing, and just seconds after we got out of it. And that's also majorly convenient. If we had decided to get a quickie from Eva, we wouldn't be able to get out of there. So again, this game's being very stupid. That part did not need to happen. Should have been just him getting out of the friggin' sewer. And, oh, not the sewer. It was a. It wasn't even a sewer. It was like a. a th it was a thing. I don't know what it was. Why that passageway was there? He got out of the passageway, and then put the trap down and just walk away. That's what it should have been. Anyway. There are people here, there's people everywhere, this is Groznygrad, security's been stepped up, apparently. Uh, do I have anything that's quiet? Well, maybe, just maybe. It would be a good idea to actually have camouflage that matches this area. I'm not sure why the game put me in camouflage that obviously would not work here. But in any case... No one there, so the driver literally did just walk away. But hey, what's this? I see some people doing nothing. They're just there to be in the way. How do I how how do I go about this? Which way do I go? I forgot. Do I go that way? No, that can't be it. That's not this isn't the right side of the building, but if I try and kill one of these guys, they'll notice. Let's try and get them to turn the opposite way around, eh? Let's just throw some food. Because these guys are starving, apparently. And that way, you should hear it. I heard it. They didn't hear it. That's amazing. Let's throw a crab at them. I'd hear that shit. That was a terrible throw. Let's try again with another crab. Come on, that was a good throw. Amazing. 10 out of 10. Wait, did someone pick that up? Hmm. This is the old standby of just knock everyone out. What's wrong? And he's not going down. Hmm. Fuck it. Go, go, go. No one will see me. And they didn't see me. Well, I was right. 